So about 35 years ago, I walked up the stone stairs of Staircase 11 in the back quad in All Souls College, Oxford, for the first time to meet my dissertation supervisor. I was a little nervous because Derek Parfit was a major figure in moral philosophy. Some regard him as the greatest moral philosopher since John Stuart Mill. He made seminal contributions in many areas, for example, in personal identity, what it is that makes me the same person I was when I climbed those steps in Oxford all those years ago. He also launched an entire subgenre in ethics when he began to reflect on our obligations to future people, people who aren't yet born. So a hugely significant figure. He was also hugely eccentric. For the last 25 years of his life, almost every aspect of his non-philosophical life was stripped away in his desperation to show that morality was objective, not just a matter of opinion. If he couldn't show that, he thought that his life, in fact all our lives, were meaningless.